Hey everybody, welcome back to Gammy's Garage. Long time viewers will know that every once in a while I like to carve things out of wood, and usually it's with the angle grinder. And Graph Tools noticed that and asked me if I wanted to try out their speed cutter. Now I learned of this tool actually through one of Tim Sway's videos, and he tried it out. It seemed to be very aggressive, although Tim was a little intimidated by that. I've wanted to try out this tool, but I just never bothered buying one. Luckily, Graph sent me one to try. The shark that I carved earlier this year was one of my most popular pieces, so I'm going to try to make another one. So let's go! So I have this piece of reclaimed heart pine. Unfortunately, it's got a crack or two running through it. So I made the last shark out of this and the dolphin out of this. And I know from experience this wood is brittle. I'll try to carve it anyway. If it doesn't work, oh well. Well, this thing is very aggressive. I think I can help myself out by cutting the excess off on a bandsaw. I was hoping to just split it along this crack, but it was a little irregular because of these knots in here. So, I think I've ruined it. Yeah, so this is disappointing. It didn't work out, but I kind of expected it. This piece of wood was not very good quality anyway. And I'm okay with that. I just wanted to try out this graph speed cutter. They asked if I could do an honest review about it, and I will certainly tell you an honest review. Overall, I like it. I'm certainly going to use it in future carvings for sure. Pros of this tool. The biggest one is the price. I think it's 15 or $20. It's very economical compared to some of the other grinding tools that I've used in my shop for wood. Second of all, it's very aggressive so you can remove material really fast. And it comes off in chips rather than dust because that fine particulate dust tends to get everywhere. Next, it's really easy to use. It just went straight on here with the nut that came with the angle grinder. I didn't need any special nut or anything. Obviously, you need to take proper safety precautions just like any other tool you put on your angle grinder. I think there's only one con to it, and that is it's a little too aggressive. It's not subtle, that's for sure. So while it's great for removing material really fast, not necessarily good for subtle work. So I would just use this for roughing. Some people seem to think this is really dangerous. I don't think so. Not any more than any other angle grinder wheel you would put on here. So overall, I think it's a great tool, honestly. So if you want to get into wood carving, this is a very economical way to start. So check out the graph speed cutter. So if you made it this far, thanks a lot for watching. You can be sure that I'll be trying more carving soon in Cammy's garage.